this will give us... Hey folks, I'm Jay. I'm Cam. We're playing an indie game that I've had for some years that I'm finally getting Jay to play. It's called uh, Mercenary Kings. Mm -hmm. uh, basically, the idea... Ah, uh, look at that guy's little dick. <laughs> um, basically, the idea is that uh, it is what would happen if um, Metal Slug was fused with Monster Hunter. Turns out to be a really, really good arcade shooter game. Basically, these little plant dudes, the Mandrakes, are super important for science reasons and have been kidnapped by the Baron. Baron Claw? Baron Claw. Didn't Inspector Gadget fight him? So there are four people on our team. Majestic, Raja, Royal, Empress, and King. Five people. I'm an idiot. So, we go off to fight Claw... Cinematics happen. Oh no, Claw's got. Oh. Well. There, that's not going great. Nope. Nope. Uh, suffice it to say, normal humans don't uh, do well against giant robots. Yeah. Typically and, not. And, like, cloned soldiers genetically enhanced by mandrake formulas. And that's the story of how everyone in the Mercenary Kings died. Except for King and Empress. They managed to recover two bodies. And we pump them full of turnip man juice. And that will make them powerful enough to fight the claw. Also, Science Lady put a cigarette out in our eyes. Oh, Jesus, no. I didn't notice that. No, I'm just making a joke. Okay. This wasn't imperative to the formula. <laughs> it was just really funny because your eye grew back real fast. And that is the plot of Mercenary Kings, such as it is. I don't know why, but just the way the general talks reminds me a lot of Gravity Falls. Yeah! Yeah, it does. I'm actually not sure what came out first, this game or the first season of Gravity Falls. It's a good question. Anyways, uh, this is going to dump us into a training mission. I kind of need it. Okay. Basically, so Cameron built me a character. Jay is a police girl with a minigun. It's um, like three of my four fetishes. It'll okay, do. so break these boxes, and it drops items. In this case, C4. But your backpack is full, because I gave you shit tons of items. So I will use the C4 to blow up this door. hee -ya! By the way, I'm, I'm, I'm the guy on the... I'm, I'm oh. the guy on the right. Oh, also bunnies. You can kill them for their pelt and shit. There's one wood. Yep. So climb this ladder. Okay. I'm like following you, man. I don't know what's going on. Okay. This is base. Oh, capybara! Meat. Small meat. Uh, Wood, oh, no. steel, and aluminum. Basically, you gather these mater- Did you fall? I did. Basically, you gather these materials in order to make weapons and armor that are used to fight the claw. Just like Inspector Gadget would have wanted. So right now, we are wildly uneven in terms of power and skill, uh, because Jay is playing a somewhat leveled up character with a minigun, uh, and has no experience with this game. None. And I am playing a level 1 character with a shitty-ass pistol, but I know a thing or two about how to play. I would imagine so. And this is reaching the crown camp, or camp crown. Which will bring us to... Mission. There we go. Yeah. Complete with these crazy characters. Yeah, we did it without dying on the tutorial mission. Against yeah, foxes and squirrels. And the occasional bird. Hey, man, that's what it took to beat Doctor Doom. Welcome to Camp Crown. This is our headquarters in the campaign against Baron and the Claw Miscreants. I've hired other freelancers to fill out the team. Blah, blah, blah. They're super good. Meet Dr. Bluebell. She'll do things to give you mods. Things. <laughs> you already know Bobby, our copter pilot, and Choppy, the sentient helicopter. Uh, we also have... Not gonna address that one. No, he, he the, it swears a lot, too. There's hmm. the spy dude, uh, Waylon and Runyon. Uh, they let you make costumes. And then there's Golden Gate, who just sells us shit, like rations and first aid kits and whatever. The world counts on you all. 
Ah ha ha, the Baron is here. My troops have intercepted your experts. How will your kings fight me without guns and blades? It's cruel to give them new life just so I can kill them. Blah, 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 blah. Kill them. And I will stab. Okay. So we need to go and rescue the gun maker and the... And the, uh, Candlestick sword maker. maker. Yes. So. Guns and blades. We must rescue one hostage from the jungle path, and they will give us $500. Come on, Jay. Right, seems fair. Come to the copter. Hold on. Still learning the controls. Also, I've kind of gotten used to the, the layout for the fucking Switch now, so that's become my life. Starting the mission. Damn. Yeah, look at those titties bounce. Those terrible 16-bit titties. Hey, man, that's all that you need. Also, is like, is the chain gun what's slowing me down? Because I am just... Un yeah, you move slower with heavier weapons. Makes sense. And uh, as you might have guessed, a minigun is significantly heavier than a pistol. That doesn't seem to matter much to fucking... What's his name? Uh, God, I actually can't remember the name of the actor now. Um, the Heavy from Team Fortress? No. Mandrix! The, the, the character that looks like... Um... He does all... Steven Seagal. That guy looks like Steven Seagal is my joke. The heavy looks like Steven Seagal? Not the heavy. That dude with the knife who was running at us. Oh, yeah. I am really bad with these traps. Yeah, may maybe don't step on the spikes. I'm trying not to. I'm still learning the jumps. The jump distances. Oh, shit. Robot sentries. Okay. So we need to head towards the X on the map, which neither of us can see right now because it's super far away. Uh, come with me, Jay. I'm coming. I'm slow and heavy. And also, watch out for the glaive, man. You have to roll. Or just shoot a lot, I suppose. <laughs> hey, man, if it works. Okay, do you want to go the easy way or the hard way? Yeah. Also, fuck that fox. Hard way it is. Okay. I should heal. Yes, you should. Because I am going to take us to fight the first hard enemy. The drill lady. Maybe shoot her head where she's vulnerable, as opposed to her drill where she's not. Eh, I liked how I did it. Glaive man. Oh shit, Stabby. Get your health item, because you used health items. I think. Nope. Can't pick it up. Yeah, I'm full up too. Oh, okay. All right. Oh, look, more Seagulls. We'll never beat the horde of Seagulls. Oh shit! Never, I dropped ever. my health item. Mine oh, now. yours now. I am fireworks. Oh fuck. Okay, I can't shoot through that. Nope. Can't shoot through wood. It's too dense. For my myriad of guns. <laughs> and bullet. I mean, you'd think I could just shoot the platform out from under him, and that would be that, but Drill no. lady! Uh-oh. Shoot her in the head! Kind of... You have to jump! You have to jump, Jay! Yeah, I got her. It's fine. So, easy way or hard way? Easy way it is. Up is easy, down is hard. Ow. <laughs> oh shit, drill lady! These enemies typically give you better drops, though. None of these drops will be valuable to you, because you are a higher level. But they will be super valuable to me with my shitty pistol. Yes. Also, okay. I am dying. <laughs> because I am super weak and not used to being super weak. Wait, stop, no, no, aww. What? If you hadn't blown that one up, we could blow this one up, and then we could make the jump and get the bonus items. Oh, okay. Watch out for the sniper, Jay. Sniper, no sniping. Man, he has got, like, the slowest bullets ever, and I don't know how to handle that. Also, I know I'm not talking a lot. I'm kind of... I'm sort of learning this, and this is new to me. Yeah, Jay's, Jay's focusing on learning how to play this what-the-fuck game I have thrust upon him. Yeah. Oh, I shit, I died. Oh yeah, I think I can revive you. No? 
Maybe. I don't think you have any stim packs. I don't. Shit. I'm gonna accelerate my death clock. Money reward gone down. Because Cameron's bad at the video game. Yep. I will catch up to you, don't worry. Yeah, probably. I like how I can just cheese this guy out. Oh yeah, you can cheese out just about everyone. This is what I... Uh, earlier I was talking to Jay, and I was... Hi, Jay. I wow. Was, I was telling him that uh, you either want to be super accurate or not accurate at all. Because when you're accurate, your bullets all go in a straight line. And when you're not accurate, your bullets fill the entire screen. <laughs> so, uh, Jay has that minigun, so he's inaccurate. So his bullets go all over the damn place. Just all over. Don't step on the spikes, Jay. I noticed. <laughs> Did you now? It's fine, I learned. Oh, dear. You landed in the spikes, didn't you, Jay? Yep. I'll be back in a minute. Oh, fuck. I accidentally unequipped my gun. Fuck. You realize that everyone between you and me has respawned, right? That's fine. Do you want me to come back and get you? No, that's fine. You sure? <laughs> I'm sure. Just drop. Just run. No, I gotta beat her or else she wins. You have iframes! Just run! <laughs> it's fine. I'm stuck. It's fine. <laughs> Those dudes you can totally just annihilate. Come on, Jay. Catch up. I'm trying. I'll come back and find you. Well, that didn't work as intended. Did you die? No, I tried to drop on the sniper and then he just punched me. <laughs> well, I mean... When I, I, when fair I... enough. Hi. <laughs> you know, you can hang off the ladder and shoot him that way. Yeah, but then he could shoot me. Yeah, but then you dodge. Dodge rolls. On the ladder? Yeah, you can roll off of anything. Or you could get distracted shooting you and I could be the hero. Yep. Me, I did that. It's intentional. <laughs> Come on, Jay. Yeah, I'm coming. Oh no, brass slugs, which are... Or brass snails, which are totally a reference to metal slug. I can't remember if you said that to me earlier or if you said that... Oh, hey, right, I forgot I could do that. Yeah, you can uh, bounce back melee uh, ranged attacks with melee. I should heal. Yeah, yeah, you should. Come on, Jay. You have more health, you're the front line. I'm going, I'm going. Kill those brass slugs. Or brass snails. Fuck. Metal slugs! Brass snails. Brass slugs, metal snails. Man, are you trying like a... Is that like a, some sort of magic spell? Is that what you do in here? No, I'm... Trying I'm, to fake me out with magic? I'm just forgetting with what thing is what meeny, thing. With your eeny, meeny, miny, moes. And your propensity for catching tigers by their toes. Also, the enemies are way stronger than they should be because there's two of us. We must save her with bullets. Sup, Dipper? Oh my god, she super looks like Dipper. Just with a ponytail and like a glow cut shirt. <laughs> Femme Dipper confirmed. Yeah. She Wouldn't that be guns. Mabel? Yeah. Old Mabel confirmed. Also, we don't ride in helicopters. We're too cool for that. Yeah. Plus, it's kind of weird when you, the helicopter's sentient. Thanks for getting me out of there. The drop zone without my guns never again. Never. This is Miss Lawless, our gunsmith. She'll be crafting guns. And this is the tablet praising Liam. May he return <laughs> one day to the two best friends. Yep. I think Liam must have been a Kickstarter backer or something. That or that's not Liam, awesome. but it Stand looks a lot like the him. the firearm fairy's gonna work her magic. Good work getting Lawless back. We're ready to head over to our bladesmith, Ironside. He's still lost. Anyway, I'm gonna see what I can do about maybe getting a better gun. Absolutely. Uh-huh.